Hey, welcome everybody out to uh, weekly online business training with Jade Baldwin. And tonight's topic is rank advancement. Understanding rank advancement, what you need to do to advance and rank in doTERRA. And we've got a few things to sh share with you. Um, should be pretty simple. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yep. So we'll want to share this screen first in the first screen. Yep, okie dokie. Um, let's go up to the first one. So it's kind of fun to rank advance, but and that's why we're in this business. We want to rank advance and then have a good income so we can uh, have the lifestyle that we, we want. Um, so if you, when you get to silver, um, actually they, they start um, from executive um, and then there's a pin for executive, a pin for, for premier, and then it keeps going. All right, so um, we had a gold this month, a new gold on our team, so she will get this gold pin. It's kind of nice. But, um, yeah, but what happens when we have that rank advancement and more than just the pins, there's other things that we need to consider. And um, I just want to share how people rank advance and just to give tips to people so that they can do the same and be inspired. So maintaining rank is the very first thing I want to talk about. Uh, we don't, re um, I think a lot of people don't realize that when you hit a rank, the very next month, you start from scratch again, <laughs> right? You, have, you, you know, you don't have to put all that much effort in like you did the month before, um, but you still have to keep trying to maintain the rank. So I had a lady that was only maybe 150 points short and she thought maybe she can purchase something under that one leg and then she hit that new rank and she was so happy that she did. And, um, and then the next month she realized she started, started over again. And I think that's a bit of a shock when you don't know that ahead of time. And, um, and then she kind of um, gave up for a couple of months just because it just was a big disappointment for her. Um, and, you know, I just want people to understand that, you know, when you hit a rank, the next rank, um, the next month, you need to try and hit it again. Um, and, and keep maintain that uh, work, um, I think, momentum. The, the thing is, I promise it gets easier. Okay, so in her mind, I think perhaps she was thinking, oh, I have to put that much effort into it again. Um, but, you know, as you train other people, as you continue to grow your business and know what you're doing, it gets much, much easier. And so pretend that you're silver and you hit gold. Um, you know, you might you know, had, you know, if you look back, you, you had a hard time hitting silver um, and now um, you hit gold. And so this month, this next month, you're going to be able to hit silver pretty, pretty easily because um, you know, you did it very well last month, but then it's the gold rank that's going to be challenging. So every month you're going to still solidify, still uh, strengthen your team, and then that gold rank will happen automatically. And you're looking forward to the next rank. You're looking forward to the platinum rank, for example. Okay, so um, just know, just know that because there's some people that hit diamond and they get paid, you know, a good amount and then the next month they don't get paid diamond. <coughs> we were pretty lucky. Um, we were paid diamond for about 11 months straight. Um, you know, I, I try to build the business in a way that the team is solid, but we are working with people here and, um, you know, Humans are humans, so uh, there's times when things don't work out very well and you, you might slip down to a different rank. Um, but, you know, your, your, your rank is that's your title forever, okay? So if you hit that rank, that's your title. But whether you get paid that rank is, um, is a different matter. But I just want people to understand that when you get to a certain rank, you still have to work on maintaining it for a while until it solidifies. So it doesn't surprise them. All right. So you okay with that? Everyone? <laughs> Lucy? <laughs> yeah, we're okay with yes, that. Yes, okay. Yeah. Um, so it, it's, it's something obvious, um, but it's not something that people think about all the time. And I uh, had a couple of people be a little bit shocked, like, you know. And, and the truth is the money 
to pay that rent comes from yeah. the volume that you sell. And so it's, it's self-sustaining. Yeah. So yeah. it's not just, uh, otherwise you, you might just go borrow a bunch of money from the bank and buy into that rank and then yeah. get that pay. Every, and you know, and but people don't understand It just that, doesn't yeah. make sense. Yeah. I, I had, when I first uh, started teaching doTERRA to people, I had a couple of people go, well, I can get to diamond then. You know, they think that if they buy into that rank and then they're done. Um, yeah. you know, and uh, that's not the case. And there, there has to be, like Ben said, the volume has to um, be from the people that are under you, and that's where you get, that's where your pay is from. So um, I think that's what makes this company very yeah. fair. Yeah, it's, it's very not fair. People at the top sitting on their butts, not yeah. working hard. Yeah, and that's exactly the little right. Indians work their little butts off for them. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. So it's not that um, pyramid scheme or whatever it is people think yeah. about. Um, nothing like that at all. So if you own a business, like a brick and mortar business, right, and people come into your store, etc., you know, you have months that are great and you have months that are not so great. And especially in our area where um, it's um, a, a holiday area. So, of course, mm. during the summertime, you, you're going to have real great business but then, you know, during the winter time, you're not going to have great business. And mm. that's the reality of things. The good thing for us is we're not paying overhead right now. You know, you're not paying for the rent. You're not paying for all these things. It's not going to kill you. That's um, right. And you have it online. So you can still be talking to people and sharing and building. So I just say expect, you know, reality. Yeah. Right. And don't be surprised. But it will flash away, but it always will be better than it was, you know, months ago, months late before, months previous. Yeah. So um, I, I feel like we're always um, moving forward, but never in a straight line. You kind of uh, zigzaggy up, but you will go up um, and just keep maintaining that momentum. All righty. And we have had people that, you know, they reach the rank of like mm -hmm. silver or something mm -hmm. and they... They just don't keep on working and, and they, yeah. they, they might have people under them that, that might keep on working and everything, but their, their business is never going to, you know, expand beyond yeah. that amount. You know, yeah. they'll, they'll never be paid more than like elite or something unless they like go into uh -huh. their business and do something about it. Yeah. And it's just another reminder, everyone, that uh, this is not a passive income business. Okay, because some people want to, they join doTERRA and they tell me, oh, yeah, I, I love uh, to have passive income business. Yeah, like, yeah, pick me, I'll join. And I'm thinking, well, you're in the wrong business if you're thinking it's a passive income. Okay, it's residual income. Um, so it's sort of like building relationships with customers and, um, you know, having that wonderful customer service, which is important because this is why doTERRA picked this model. They could have a brick and mortar business. They can have, you know, shops and centers everywhere. But in order for a, each individual person to apply the actual usage of the oils, they, they need education. And this yeah. is your job. Your job is to have a relationship with people and be edu educating them on a regular basis until they've, you know, they are self-sufficient and independent um, and so that's our goal is to teach our team members to be independent and to um, help them do things on their own. And so you can move on and help other people. Um, so I had grieved a little bit this week, you know, um, I think I held it in a little bit and then I, I cried because I, I see how all my teammates are growing up and <laughs> moving on. And I think they don't need me anymore. This is amazing. This is wonderful. But then it's, it's sort of like, um, <laughs> that grief of mom, I think. So it's, it's so exciting for, to watch people and I, I just love the way they, they grow bigger and better. And, um, uh, you know, that's, that's the idea. So if people thinking, oh no, I have to work that hard forever, they, you know, I can see how they get disappointed, but you don't have to work that hard forever. Okay, we're not, um, the way we run our business is not just uh, replenishing, replenishing. And some people do it that way, I know. They keep on finding new blood, new blood, new blood. Um, but for us, we um, nourish who we have and, and we teach them to nourish other people. And um, our foundation is solid. 
um, yeah, I had lunch with a lady today and same thing. I think um, she's, she had no idea about anything on the other products. And I thought, oh, and I meet people like that all the time. They hit silver and then and I have lunch with people and say, hey, join us, gang. And they, I'm like, congratulations, you're silver, and, you know, on another team. And, um, you know, we're talking and then come to find out, they're like, what's Terrazyme? Yeah, you know, like, oh, you know, Terra Zine? And what's this? What? You know, no. And so what we deliver is, um, you know, a bigger message than just come to our store and buy our stuff. Yeah. It's a holistic, let's change your lifestyle. Let's change the world message and uh, let us teach you to, to heal. Um, so that's why, you know, your work is important, but it's not going to be like this, um, rat race forever but some people feel that way and it's not you know actually um you know we have a lot more time now <laughs> but um yeah we're we're busy doing fun things that we like all righty so the second point here is get an overview of the compensation so what you need to do is um overview the compensation over and over again um you know i get an overview every time i teach the compensation to somebody else and when you teach it, you try to explain it, ideas and connections happen in your brains that uh, help you focus on what you need to do next. Um, I, I am often surprised, I think, when I um, see people and, they, and I said, did you know that you're this close to this next rank? And they have no idea. And, um, you know, if, it's, if they're the, the, you know, the beginning ranks, I get it. But once they get up to the higher ranks, it's like, really? You know, I'm, I'm almost gold, I'm almost silver, I'm almost premier, what? Um, and I think to myself, well, they need to be teaching the basic compensation or overviewing it, somehow mm -hmm. overviewing in their minds so they can see how possible it is and all how close they are to that next rank. Of course, you, they're, they're checking their teams and seeing the numbers and that's a weekly task that we need to do. Um, but you know, if you're elite and you have 5,000 volume, you might want to see <laughs> where your volume is because that might have qualified you for premier already and you're leaving money on the table. Okay. So what we're going to quickly do, Ben, do you want to run through the compensation here? Just to overview. So we're going to switch gears here. Okay, so this is just a business basic package that you can find at jadebalden.com. Um, and um, there, it basically reviews the compensation plan up front. So there's um, five ways. You've got retail sales, which is not really part of the compensation plan, but you can get um, compensation by reselling oils or sending people to your replicated website. Um, there's fat, fast start, which is, you know, compensation for introducing people to doTERRA. Power of three, um, you know, when you, when you have the right structure, unilevel and leadership. So I'm just gonna go through a few of those. There's a fast start. Um, <clears throat> you introduce someone to doTERRA. So this is paid to the enrollers. You enroll someone, you're getting 20% of their, um, what they, spend in the first 60 days comes to you um if you in that's pv point isn't it that's right mm -hmm. yeah. and if they enroll someone then you get 10 percent of their enrollee mm -hmm. and down the line five percent so that 35 percent is split up amongst who enrolled that person so whoever enrolled you is going to get 10 percent you know when you enroll someone and their enroller is going to get um five percent so that's fast start. Um, power of three is uh, how you organize your team. Um, you have three people under you, and you and those three people all have a combined volume of 600 points. Um, they all, and each of you have um, a personal volume of 100 points or more on an LRP order. That qualifies you for the first power of three bonus. It's 50, and if those three people under you do the same thing, that's 250, and if they have three people under them, do the same thing, that's 1,500 extra. So it just encourages you to build so that when you, you're not just building volume, but you're actually going to build to rank. Mm 
-hmm. So the incent incentive is there from the beginning to organize your structure. And it has a lot of um, important reasons for doing that. Um, you're sharing the, because you basically, when you put people under you, you're supporting those people and you, you're sharing that support with other people. So it's not that you're putting everybody under directly under you and they're going to get a bad customer experience because you can't service that many people when they come to you with questions or calls or basically teaching them about the products and everything. So, all right. So the next one is, can I just say that not all companies, not all network marketing companies can afford to, to um, pay that, um, power of three they you know doTERRA is so clever in the way that they they organize and they're very generous to start with um to incentivize people to do that and because they incentivize people to do that people start growing the proper way yeah so the next one is you know uh number five unit level uh whereas you're after this first 60 days um you're paid based on the volume of your um of the organization under you up to seven levels deep and you just paid on a percentage two three five the percentage gets bigger as you go down um that's um the basics of that and when you get to the leadership um like silver and above you're also paid a portion of the leadership um pool in it's a, it's six percent of the company's profits worldwide and that's paid to you um for basically being a leader and having grown your business to that, that height. And is that where they've added another one? The yes, you're yep. right. Recently they've, added, they've, they've added yeah. Empowered, the empowered, um, yeah. and I'll explain that one. That's actually relevant to you right now because you're heading towards that. <laughs> um, you have to be premier, and premier is um, two legs of 2,000 volume. And um, with a total of 5,000 um, over, overall, uh, OB, okay, overall volume. Yeah. So that means 5,000 um, and two, two, two legs of 2,000 within that, that, sure. that group. Um, so that is encouraging you to start building uh, properly so you can reach that next rank of silver. Anyways, if you have one personal enrollment this month and um, you hit premiere so that means you satisfy all of those requirements then you are going to be paid an extra share and this share is just um, incentivize you to um, you know to fund and help fund you so you can um, put it back into the business and, and um, move forward to the next rank which is silver and when does that start this month <laughs> they get paid this month yeah. and, um, and that's about uh, 190 um, USD so that's a little bit more in Australian dollars but that's kind of exciting and the silvers they're pretty lucky because they get one silver share and one empowered share so they get the empowered mm -hmm. share too if they have one enrollment and um, they hit the silver rank. So they have the silver share and the um, empower share on top of that. So that's a little bit more money for the silvers. Uh, that again, to incentivize people to keep up the momentum. Um, you know, you don't have to go too crazy, but it's like keep sharing, keep building, keep, um, you know, helping out with your team and supporting your team, okay? So that's the idea. But when you hit Premier, you see there that you get paid five levels deep. Like six levels, five levels deep. Yeah. So yeah. two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, six yeah. levels deep. Um, and yeah. then silver and above is everything. Yeah, that's everything right. And silver and above yeah. is, um, you know, the whole complete seven levels. And that's exciting because uh, if, even if you have more levels below, um, you know, they will push up as much of um, the volume as they can, yeah. for God's sake. So if people are, are on 50 or less, um, the computer will find the next person that's on 100, but that person that's on 50 or less, you still get paid for them. So in reality, you get paid a lot more. So that's exciting. Yeah. So it's cool. important, um, since we're talking about rank advancements, um, the premier 
uh, up to elite, you don't need any personal enrollments required to reach those, or, or those organization ranks. necessarily. Yep, all, all, it's all based on organizational volume. But to become premier, you have to have personal enrollments. Mm -hmm. that, that, that's why you know, even if you like maybe introduce someone, um, someone put someone under you um, when they're signing people up, um, if you don't go out there and sign people up yourself, you don't have those personal enrollments, the most you'll ever be paid is elite and only for um, five levels deep. Mm -hmm. So that um, it starts to build up when you have your personal enrollments. This is kind of the demarcation of these are the people who are building the business. Yeah. Um, so what does the plus two times mean? Is that two personal enrollments? Two legs. Two legs of executive. Oh, two legs, yeah. Yep. Okay, yeah. Silver is three, three legs, legs of executive. executive. Yeah, we should have put maybe three executives there. Um, yeah. yeah. On the other sheet. Yeah. Yep. And three premieres for the gold. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Okie dokie. So, you know, if we, if we review the compensation plan, um, well, then we know the different rules. Um, you know, so we don't, we're not surprised. How, can, how come I'm not rank advancing? <laughs> What's happening? Um, it's just, you know, they, they have the rules spelled out there. If you can follow it, if you do exactly as, um, as outlined, then you'll get the results that you want. So it's not terribly difficult. It's not a, a guessing game or a chance game. Um, the other thing that I uh, tell people to do is um, really follow the compensation plan. I, I know a few people who think, oh, I'm going to hit presidential diamond anyways. So they start out with six, seven legs and they try to build everyone all together, you know, all over the place, um, thinking that they're just going to get all the rank all at once. And uh, doTERRA built it this way so that you can be funded and taken care of as you rank. Yeah. I had one lady do that. She burned herself out, just trying really hard to take care of six teams. Um, so as you go, you, you know, with Premier, you've got two legs to you taken care of until they're strong. Yeah. And then you add another leg, and then you build that one. And but these other legs, that they're self-sufficient now. Okay, you're working with this silver leg. Um, you know, and and with a gold, I have a, a gold on our team, and you know, she has these two legs that are just amazing, self-sufficient now. And so she only has one leg to really grow to yeah. single rank, which means she's going to be platinum soon. So that's amazing. Um, you see, that's what we aim to do. And so you still can have a good family life, <laughs> but then have money uh, to pay for your business and, and compensate you as you go along. Okay, so you don't just have you know, very little income for a long time and all of a sudden you blue diamond or presidential diamond. The doTERRA worked it very well. Um, so just follow it, I say, okay? Um, so the next thing I uh, tell people to do is to draw out their team often. So you can just get one of those magic markers or, get, um, or a whiteboard marker, just draw it out. Um, I just draw it out on a piece of paper when I first, uh, you know, was in doTERRA. I didn't um, remember, um, you know, all the compensation um, little de details. So what I did was I had to kind of draw it out because sometimes your team looks a little bit messy with all the other people in between and you can't see the teams that you're really building. So if you draw them out, write their names down, then you can visualize. And then if you're missing anyone or you're missing, then you know exactly where the next enrollment's gonna go. Mm -hmm. So if you say, look, on so-and-so, the second leg has, is missing one person here. So I'm going to build that leg. Anytime I focus on any leg, that leg grows. So no, it's, it's amazing that way. So <laughs> I had one leg um, that, uh, my, you know, I, I really wanted to build and she was always weak and I put some champions under his champions and then I had a silver and then I had a pr premiere under her. And so that leg was like um, 15,000 every month instead of just the 3,000 that I wanted because I'm like, I can need a team to be above 3,000 every month. And it's, you know, any way you focus your energy, that will grow. But um, just know where you're focusing instead of just, oh, and I'll enroll somebody and I'll put some people somewhere, I don't know. Um, really figure it out because as soon as you can focus that energy, you will find the person for that spot. 
So I said, the next person's gonna go here and that person actually fits there perfectly. Yeah. So that's drawing out your team, guys. Um, and visualize it and you can cross out the names and change the names and um, adjust it but keep drawing so you know where everybody is visually in your mind okay so when I talk about a team member I actually see them on a certain leg on a certain team in my mind and then I place them that way and that, that's how come I remember a lot of names too so I make that connection um, and as you can see on the screen the next thing is tap root Okay, that means you know your team members. So you have the leader, and some leaders are fantastic, and they they work well with you, and um, you know they answer calls, e answer emails, and you know they, they're active. And um, some of them are still figuring out who they are, what they're doing here, and that's fine. But when they have the team members under them, um, I can't leave those team members um, lost and just. To figure out the doTERRA membership and oils on their own. I just feel bad. Um, so I ask permission to make friends. Sometimes those people don't even know the people who are under them um, and very well. So I just reach out to them and, um, and, you know, make friends with them and then see what I can do for them. And sometimes if that person wants to understand more about the oils for their health concern, that's what I give them. If they want to uh, make a, you know, a little bit of money to, on the side, that's what I help them do. If they want to grow big and um, make this their business, then that's what I help them do. But I just reach out and find out what their needs are. And so, you know, sometimes these little people under them, they become, you know, these big champions and it kind of excites and awakens the leader, their, their leader, and, um, and their leader might get excited and do the business. Other times it doesn't work that way, which is fine. Um, but, uh, you know, everybody deserves some sort of a, a support because this is why we organize our teams. Mm -hmm. And ideally these team leaders, they're supporting those people you have to train those leaders sometimes to support your their leaders their people yeah so i i sometimes jump in and i do mentoring for those people uh, and then i i try to hand it over to them and say look you continue so we have a really good um system um but uh you know we just have to apply it you know doTERRA organizes it and encourages you to organize it that way and it's brilliant Okay, any questions? That's no, working brilliantly for me. Yeah, <laughs> doing what you're doing. Uh -huh, yeah. Okay, so that's it. So we've done, we've talked about maintaining rank. We talked about, um, you know, overviewing the compensation, following the compensation plan and drawing out your team and then tap root. Um, and that's, that's beautiful because sometimes you, these roots, all you need, like you over there, you see that you have, um, a silver is three elites. So if you can just get volume growing under certain three leaders, three, yeah. yeah, three elites. Executives. Sorry, it's supposed to be elites. I mean, I have to change that now. Oh, yeah. You're right. Yeah. So um, that's why it's yellow. <laughs> we have a typo. So three elites under uh, the silver, um, and mm -hmm. that makes them silver. So if you have a leader that's not doing much, and you have people underneath them doing stuff, and they get the volume, that leader yeah. will automatically rank advance to elite ten ways, and yeah. Uh, yeah, that will help you be silver. Yeah. yeah. Eventually, we want to encourage them to do the business and start rolling their own business yeah. and organizing. But at least it doesn't hold you back. Yep, it doesn't hold you back. That's right. That's yeah, yeah. And that's beautiful about this business because then people don't feel yeah. pressured, and yeah. they're not they don't have that conflict. Um, yeah, so that's good, and then. Um, and then other point here is put champions under champions. Sometimes I see people say, hey, I've got this fantastic person. They're going to do really well. They're going to build the business. They've got tons of friends. Um, you know, they're out there, they're outgoing. Uh, I think that's fantastic. Um, but you already have existing legs. So place those champions under those legs um, if, it, if those legs are still not very solidified. Okay, because you want this to be a long-term business, all right, and so you want it to be just solid and you want um, just backup. <clears throat> Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah. Um, 
and remember like what Ben said, you don't want to spread yourself out too thin because it's about customer service, about being there to support your team. So if you can share the load, much better for everyone. Okay, so that's champions under champions and then visualize and own the next rank already. Um, I feel that um, when you hit a rank, you think, I still can't believe it, I'm still pinching myself. And, um, and it's great and you're, you're in that honeymoon phase. Um, but afterwards, right, own that rank because that becomes your rank and it becomes, uh, you, you easily hit that rank um, when you own it. Um, and then once you own that rank, adopt the next rank as soon as you can. So say that your goal to right now, um, enjoy it for the next couple of months, but then own the next month, uh, next rank, excuse me. So we're diamonds now, and that's what I'm working on doing, um, just owning that blue, blue diamond rank. And it feels more like um, something familiar now. Um, so I remember that feeling when uh, we're almost there with diamond. I just felt like it's in the bag. <laughs> I feel like it's already there. I can see myself. I can feel it. I can see the amount of money. I can see the number of team mates. I can just own it. Um, and anything you can do to really feel it and see it uh, helps. Because I know that a lot of um, uh, work I do with people, um, they, we, they just have such a hard time um, spending time picturing it. They, they picture what might fail, they picture all their fears, but they don't entertain um, the possibility that of, of the successes. And what does it look like? What does it feel like? Where do you want to go? What is your life going to be like as a diamond? What, you know, where will you be? And they haven't really given themselves a chance to think about it, that's all. So that's, um, that's one thing that I think I encourage people to do. And the last one is attract and work with business partners. Sorry, Ben, did you want to say anything? No, you don't, about all this? Okay, the last thing here we want to talk about is just to attract and work with business partners. Um, so you're not doing this on your own. This is not just your business. You run a cooperation. And so, um, uh, you know, like I said, with an elite person, you want your leader to be a business partner because when they, when you want them to be premier, okay, they have to want that premier rank too. And they have to want to enroll people um, and be working with you. So, you know, attract business builders as soon as you can. Um, then you have partners to work with. Yeah. Good. And say anything else, Ben? No, that's pretty much it. Any questions, Lucy? No, no, it, it, it's just a perfect plan. And yeah, when you attract the kind of business partners that you really enjoy working with, this whole journey is just exciting. It's fun. Yeah, yeah it is. It's sort of a big cause you're joining. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, so sometimes when we place people under people, uh, people forget to talk to their upline. So it's like, hey, there's a team here that I want to build. I'm just going to put the next five people down here. And they forgot, forget to say, hey, I'm going to check with, you know, Mary to see if Mary is able to partner with me and support these new people, right? And, um, you know, there's new people. I don't think that they need to necessarily know that you're going to place them under Mary because it's not going to matter for them. And sometimes it kind of them and turns them off like what and this is just confusing i thought like join with you well, well, what's going on yeah. Yeah, yeah let them use the oils let them experience it and then you can tell them about things um like that yeah. and um yeah. yeah i i've never had a problem with it except just the one lady just one lady had a problem with it but she was already worried about being used and abused by people in the world so that was you know usually people are like oh okay and i said the upline that um you know, you're with, she's going to be able to help you because I feel like you guys are going to work really well together. Um, but of course, I'm, I'm, you know, you're all under me. You're all my friends. Okay. 
And uh, yeah, in that way, and a lot of people, they, they step up. They're like, what am I meant to do? Do I call them? Do I, you know, so just make friends with them on Facebook or something and reach out to them um, if they need to. Uh, yeah, and I've successfully reached um, certain teammates on my team that I didn't enroll. But you, sometimes you reach down, you make friends and then um, make friends for life. And yeah, and that's what I mean by, you know, attracting business partners and encouraging people to be business partners with you. Yeah, making it very easy. Yeah. Good. That's all about rank investments. Yes. <laughs> well, that's yeah. all for tonight, I guess. Um, not too much about it. Uh, yeah, not too much to it. So, yeah, it's exciting. And Terra, they they recognise you and they um, throw a big party and things. And <laughs> I think that's, yeah. Yeah. That's great. When we hit Diamond, um, Emily Wright texted, texted us and congratulated us. And yeah, they're so personable. Yeah, the the manager, the Australian doTERRA manager called and um, another person called from the office and like, wow, <laughs> <laughs> they all know us. They know what's happening. And yeah. So nice. That's awesome. All righty, we'll end here if that's all we have to say. Okay, thank you, everyone. Cool. I'll just stop the recording. Yep.